Okay, the next uh, experiment that we're doing is all about the river gradient. The idea is that uh, the river gradient changes throughout the long profile from when the source through to where it finishes at the mouth. And so we should be able to see a slight change because obviously that we assume that the water is flowing downhill. So we should be able to work this out. So what you have to do is you work out a 30 metre stretch. You'll have a tape measure. You'll place your ranging poles between the, the start and the finish. And it's very important that they're kept uh, upright. Some of you, if you've got your mobile phone, you could even have that with the spirit level and to uh, check and to make sure it's correct. You'll also need, therefore, a clinometer. And this works by working out the, the angle. So you look through the side of it, and it, inside it's got a measurement, which are also read here. So quite obviously, if I tip it at an angle, the numbers suddenly change, and the idea is that you record it and work out how much the, uh, the angle is. So what happens is one person stands here and they have their finger and the point here. So this is the way you're aiming at. So we're aiming for this point here and another person will stand at the bottom 30 meters away with the clinometer and they will look through and they will work out the angle between the two points and then they'll record that down. And the idea is then perhaps that this stretch is different from the stretch further downstream, which is different from the ones upstream. So we'll have a go at that now.